Hello guys and welcome back to the channel! In today's video guys, we are going to find out who my movie star girlfriend is. There are so many possibilities, so many beautiful women out there, so many beautiful movie stars out there. We have our Scarlett Johansson, we have our, our Megan Foxes, our Jessica Albas. The possibilities are endless. But I've got this quiz right in front of me. It's gonna, it's gonna help me out find out who I'm best matched with in the movie industry. It's, uh, it's. I don't even know how many questions there is. It just says quiz. Who is your movie star girlfriend? And our first question says, how would you describe yourself? And it's got a picture of fine ass Jessica Alba. So, how would I describe myself? Reading the options below, I see it says, you, I love all things artsy. Um, I'm okay with that. Um, I always date the popular girls. I was never one to date the popular girls just because I wasn't a popular guy. Um, and uh, I just didn't have, never had the chance to. So, I, I'm going to scratch that one out. Um, I'm a jock and love to play sports. Anyways, moving on. Um, I like to work behind the scenes. Um... I, I, I mean, it's a toss up between one and two. I don't, I'm not really that artsy, but I do like artsy stuff. But um, I like to keep it low key. I like to be low key about things, so I'm gonna work behind the scenes. So let's pick that one and move on to the next question. It says, Which type of girl would you date? It's got a picture of a sandal. I don't know why, but it does. It says, One, one who loves hot pink roses. Okay. One who loves to play golf. I'm not a big fan of golf. Golf is boring, guys. I hate it. I'm sure playing it is fun, but watching it on TV is just unbearable. So number three is one who has a chihuahua and a cat and a lizard. Chill with that. I'm not about chihuahuas. It's a pitiful dogs. Cats, I'm not a big cat fan. And lizards, is just weird. And then it says one who collects shoes. You know what? This might be controversial, but I'm gonna pick the one who collects shoes. Why? Because I love a woman in heels. They're freaking hot! So let's pick that one. One who collects shoes. It's expensive, but she's a movie star, so she can she can finance her own collection. How smart would your girlfriend be? She got six A's on her finals. I mean I do I do enjoy a smart girl because you know you want you wanna be able to hold a conversation with that special someone and not just, you know. Uh, you know, stare at her blankly and just no, no. Um, she skipped a grade and will graduate early. Ooh. She has an IQ in the 160s, which is a genius. You know, for those who don't, I like how they put that in the like parentheses. Just for those who don't know, 160 is a genius. And it says she goes to an artsy school, which I guess the least smart one. I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna go with. I don't know. I mean, just because she goes to an artsy school doesn't mean she's not smart. We'll see what happens. Next question says, what sign are you compatible with? I don't follow this. Aries, Libra, and Sagittarius. Uh, so it's the second one or the... F I'm going to go with the first second one. Just because this, this one is not important because I don't follow this. So whatever. Next question says, what special powers does your ideal girlfriend have? Fight off spiders? I guess that's a special power. She can she has the best soccer moves. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I do like my soccer athletes, you know, Alex Morgan. Amor. Anyways, she can wear boots and fight any guy. She is a superhero who can turn invisible. So I don't want her to wear boots and fight any guy because I mean she's going to be stronger than me and she can beat me up and I like to feel masculine in my relationship. So I'm going to say she has the best soccer skills um, just because maybe she can teach me a thing or two and uh, I don't want to be mad at that. I'm not mad at that. So let's, let's go on with that one and go continue. What's your favorite class in school? So it's asking me what my favorite class in school was. I've got gym, choir, history, or art. Gym, I wasn't a big gym guy because I didn't like getting too sweaty during school days. I usually had like gym like in the middle of the day. So past the first couple periods, then I got gym and I'm sweaty for the remainder of the day. It didn't work out, so I just didn't know. So gym wasn't it. Choir, uh, nope. I never went to choir in school. History, it was boring as hell. So I guess the most likely one here would be art just because I did like to goof around and play around in art. So let's go with that one. 
Where do you want to live? Where do I want to live? New York, it's a beautiful place. Um, very, very crowded. Too crowded for me. Too much going on in New York for me. I don't like that. Um, Texas is just too hot. No way, I'm living in Texas. London, it's it's rainy. It's rainy all the time. I don't know. I don't know. If you're from London, tell me. Let me know how rainy it's out there. But as far as I know, it's raining quite often out there or very cloudy. I like sunshine, so I'm gonna pick California because who doesn't want to live in California? Like that's that's the place to be. So let's go to California. What's your personal style? Yo, Scarlett Johansson in that picture, though. Anyways, my personal style, classic and old school. Um, I don't know if it's talking about clothing or just the way that I am. I think it's I think it's just the way that I am. Am I am I sporty and casual? I, I like to think I'm not I'm not preppy or sleek. I mean, you can tell. I don't do my hair. I become a bitch. Nope, not me. I'm gonna say sporty and casual because I like to be comfortable in my clothing. So sporty and casual. What's your favorite after school activity? Playing soccer. I did like playing soccer. It was it was good. Um, starting in the school play, I was never into theater, so I never did that. I'm the quarterback for the school football team. Nope, I never played football. And playing video games with my friend. I guess I'm gonna pick playing soccer because out of the four, I think that's the most likely one that I did. So let's go with that one. Um, so it's movie night. Which movie are you going to watch? I have Home Alone three, uh, Rugrats, Flipper. Bend it like Beckham. I have not seen that one. Isn't that like a documentary? I don't know. I'm not into documentaries. Rugrats is a good cartoon. I did enjoy the movie, but that's not something I would watch more than once. Uh, Home Alone 3, I enjoyed, and I would definitely. I, I think I definitely watched it more than once or twice. I'm gonna pick Home Alone 3 because I think I've seen that one more than once, and I think I will probably watch it again. Ooh, congratulations! This is, this is my movie star. Your movie star girlfriend is Kira Knightley. Who's Kira Knightley? Let's check her out. Come on, Google, tell me who Kira Knightley. Ooh, it's <gasps> oh, I thought she was the one from. Uh, I thought she was the girl from um, from uh, the movie Tomb Raider. That's what she looked like with this from far away, but I don't think that's her. All right, guys. So this is this is my youth. This is my my celebrity girlfriend, and I'm not mad at it. She's gorgeous. Let me let me go on Twitter, and I'm gonna tweet at her, guys. I'm gonna tell her she's my new girlfriend. I think it's her. Official tweets from her. She's from London, UK. Oh man, I wanted to live in California, but you know what? I can deal with a little bit of like clouds for her. So let me. Ooh! Hey, Tootsie Roll. XOXO. Love you. How do you make the kissy face? I'm on, I'm on a PC, so I don't know how to make the kissy face here. I think it's. I think it's like this. Like this. Hey, I don't remember how to make the kissy face. And tweet. Your tweets and that means that. Yeah, we're gonna wait, guys, and find out if she ever replies. I'll, I'll get back to you guys on that. I'm sure she will. She's my girlfriend. She has to, right? But, anyways, guys, that is it for today's video. Um, we found out who my uh, celebrity girlfriend is going to be in the next couple of years. You know, once my YouTube status goes pa 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 through the roofs. But, anyways, guys, that's it for today's video. Thank you, I guess. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys made it this far in the video. But until next time, guys, I'll see you on um, the next video. Let's go! Baby,